Good evening, uh, Brian Steves here. I'm glad that you could join me um, in chatting a little bit about your child's music education in our class guitar, beginning guitar class here at Kamiak High School. I'm really glad your, your son and daughter is taking music here at high school, and guitar is a great instrument to take on um, at their age or any age. Um, some instruments you need to start real young to have you know, success at because you don't want to start the violin too late in life because you know how you sound. But vi but the uh, but the guitar is a forgiving instrument, um, and although all instruments are hard to play well, um, the guitar is one instrument where you can get confidence fairly quickly, and um, it's such a versatile instrument, and you can carry it onto a plane and things. And so, um, wise decision on your child's part on picking picking up music and picking up the guitar. Um, I just say that I've been teaching music here in Muckleteal for 35 years, and um, you know you may know that I'm the orchestra director, but um, I I love teaching music, and it's it's really great to have the kids who have not done music maybe for a couple of years or maybe ever, and to be finding music now. And um, my orchestra kids are wonderful, but they've been doing it for you know hours and hours every day, and. Um, so this, your kids are, are fun to have and to, um, to, to find such a, you know, remind themselves of the joy that music can bring. So um, thanks for that. So what I am trying to accomplish in this time together is to gain the musical skills, take the skills to perform with others and by themselves, confidence in their musical abilities. To continue the stage, we do have three levels of guitar. So this can be an experience or it could be just the start. And... Um, to have fun and enjoy making music. Um, it's not a high level performance type class, um, but the kids are definitely um, developing their musical sensibilities and some technical skills um, using the guitar as their jumping point. So it's a, it's the go semester goes by fast, um, but I really like the, the curriculum I use that gets them through a lot of literature, I think, and some really fun songs. You may recognize some of these. Um, we always start out with um, what we call in the biz the camp songs because we have to start, you know, with pretty simple choral pieces. But we get f fairly sophisticated um, with a bunch of different strumming patterns, and we work at learning to read a lead sheet so the kids can. There's so much music on the internet and um, play alongs and lots of things that that is open to them. So I try to keep. Uh, show them some of those technical, technical um, menus as well. We start with with mostly strumming, but we also will be doing some melodic playing, and um, and then a little bit of finger picking. You know, arpeggiated at the end. That's really pretty difficult, but I want to introduce it so the kids can get an experience because some people really really like it. And um, we do just some singing in, as well as playing in class, and they're. Finding their singing voices again, which is great. They again, this is not a big performance-oriented um, class, but they do, um, and most of their quizzes are done. You know, just they're in little practice groups called friendship circles, and um, I go over and when they're ready to to quiz, then I'm you know I listen to them individually and and. Um, you know, give them some hints on how to improve and just let them know the things that they're doing well. Um, but they will do a couple performances in class in small groups um, um, where one person may play, play melody, another person will do the chords, and maybe a third person will play the bass line on their guitar. So they get a little ensemble experience and a little bit of performance um, in there, which is, you know, good skills to have. Uh, most of the grading is on their... Um, their quizzes, and we're just finishing up the first quiz. We start out a little bit on the slow side because I, I spend a lot of time with instruction, and now I gradually release it more to their independent time where they're in their small groups in the class, and I'm going around helping them or quizzing them. And um, and so we're going to get more uh, quizzes in at, a, at least once a week um, from here on out. They do get some points for working during their daily practice time. Um, and then we do, just like other music classes where we have all musicians in a room together, we could depend on each other to be able to move forward. I can't really move along with the curriculum until I hear that most of the students are 
are getting what I'm teaching. And so um, we do like to make sure everyone is paying attention and working together um, because we can only go as fast as the team really allows. So, um, so I like to point out when they're, when they're being team players and when they could use some help in that area.